Hey, Channel 4 viewers. Welcome to the Web School. My name is Ray Broadhead, and I'm the head of the Web School. And we're going to show you why we're the coolest of the cool schools. This morning, it is round two of cool schools for this new school year. And Aaron is live out in Bedford County at the Web School yeah. in Bellbuckle. Hey, good morning, Aaron. I see you have Snowbird with you. Yes, Snowbird is always here on Cool Schools. Snowbird's in the house. And we're actually at Web School in Bellbuckle, Tennessee. We're in a sea of feet. Yes, the Web Feet. That's the nickname of the athletic teams. We're actually in the dining hall. And they have a, a uh, omelet station. My man Dylan, what kind did you get? I got the works. Got the works. He's got fresh made omelets. We got all kinds of cool stuff here at the Web School. About 300 students, 6 through 12. It is the only boarding school in Middle Tennessee. Here's some cool stuff about the Web School. First thing you notice at Web School, it's a boarding school, the only one in the entire mid-state, and thus they have dorms. Uh, what do you think about dorm life in high school? Um, I've lived here four years, but I really think dorm life is super important here because it really prepares you for college. I'm already is it almost like going to college? Right? Yes, yes. Right now I'm in the ninth grade, and I think that college is going to be a great is going to be just like web because it prepares you it's it's awesome so you're from jamaica how did you even hear about the web school uh well it was a boarding school consultant that was there you know wanted to come to a boarding school and so yeah I spoke to him and got here how long have you been here uh two months yeah. two months all right so what do you think it is Pretty great. It's a pretty awesome experience, to tell you the truth. So you hadn't heard of Bell Buckle before? I don't think many people in Nashville have heard of Bell Buckle. <laughs> but... So what's that like coming from the other side of the world to a boarding school in Tennessee? It's so different. Well, first, like every morning when I was at home, I uh, have sex. When I woke up, I was like, Mom, where's the breakfast? Mom, um, make my bed, please. But when I get here, it's like everything just depends on myself. So I have to get up and make my bed and do things and change clothes and everything. No mom anymore. Yeah, so boarding school, very unique. It really gets you ready for college. Now, the new head of the school, Ray Broadbent, uh, from the Northeast, Massachusetts area. You've only been here like three months, but how do you like it here? It's a great school. There's a lot of neat people here. The parents are very supportive. The students are here because they want to learn. They really are very great kids. They're excited. They, uh, they have great opportunities here because it's such a small school. Many of them are leaders in very, various areas. They play sports. They work hard in the school. It's just been a lot of fun. All right, Ray Broadbent, Web School. We'll have much more of the next couple hours, Holly. And I, I got to find one of those omelets. It looks pretty good, huh? <laughs> hey, that's what Paul and I were just going to say. The omelet station, you need to bring some of that back. Look at those students. Yeah, and we got, we got some waffles coming up, too. So we got oh. waffles and omelets and uh, all kinds of cool stuff Tempting over the next us. couple hours. Tempting us all right. this morning. Sixth through twelfth grade. Pretty cool stuff, though, on Cool School. All right, thank you, Aaron. Web School there out in Bell Buckle. Good folks out that way. Is something else cool here at Web School? The masses headed to chapel. I was like, are you So they have chapel every day at the same time, and they have very often something they call a declamation. We're going to see one of those today. An oncology ward is a battlefield, and there are definite hierarchies of command. The patients, they're the ones doing the tour of duty. The doctors breeze in and out like conquering heroes, but they need to read your child's chart to remember where they've left off from the previous visit. What is a declamation? A declamation is a recitation of a memorized piece of literature. You got all kinds of stuff wrapped into chapel. I mean, gathering, being together, the togetherness, announcements, and also the practice of public, of public speaking. And, and that's very much a part of, uh, of the school's academic uh, tradition. A life I would never imagine for myself. Sort of like Ready? All right, very cool. Chapel every day, public speaking, a big deal here at, at Webb School here in Bell Buckle. Now, we had the minute to win it. Obviously, the girls much better than the guys at noodling around. Pretty good. The guys, ah, they kind of messed up. But Claire got all six of the noodles on the noodle. Noodling around, minute to win it. Lots of fun here at Webb School, Holly.
We'll have more coming up. More yeah. fun. Why didn't you do that, buddy? We need to see you do some well, uh, uh, minute to win it competition. Yeah, there. I, I'm waiting for the waffle eating contest. <laughs> I'm all about the oh, eating okay. contest. You gotcha, know. gotcha. Hey, and that declamation stuff, that's pretty cool. Way to go. Great to Very experience cool. for them public speaking. Okay, Aaron, we'll be checking back oh, in with yeah. you live out in Bedford County, Web School in Belmont. I am ready to eat, and so, so are these guys, and it's a good thing we're in the dining hall. Right now, we are having a waffle eating contest. This is a cool school's first, and uh, how many waffles can you eat in three minutes? We just got started. Got to chew, got to chew, got to chew. I'm ready to eat. This is cool. Here's some more cool stuff about the web school. All right, something else really cool here at the web school. This bunch of people, they're special because they're the honor council. Um, it's a group of people and we, we, I don't know, we kind of just get together and if anyone lies, cheats, or steals, we meet. Sonny Webb said do nothing on the sly. Basically, don't um, commit one of the five honor offenses. Um, lying, cheating, stealing, conspiracy, and plagiarism. You know, be on time, be where you need to be when you're supposed to be there. Your peers choose you, but I think it's a really great thing because I grew up in public schools and to be able to come here and, you know, leave your backpacks out, leave stuff out, and people won't touch them, it's really great because you're able to trust all of your friends. Recommended that he create a uh, council of students to reprimand them, reprimand instead of kicking them all out, which he wanted to do. Basically, the whole student body knows that other students are kind of, I mean, you're all watching out for each other, kind of, right? I think, I, I think so, and it's sort of, um, lets the students know that they'll be treated fairly. What's pretty impressive is that the honor code here has actually spawned other honor codes at other schools. Yeah, um, like colleges have them, like Vanderbilt and Princeton. And so, yeah, it's like... And they came after yeah. yours. Yeah, it was based off ours. The honor council is cool and with school. So how about that? This school's been around 141 years. This school's honor code inspired the honor code at Princeton. So that means, Holly, that nobody is cheating at all during this waffle eating contest. And I, I gotta get to eating, all right? Back to you. Oh, my stars, you are torturing us here at the station. Wow, that's looking good though, my friend. So is your mouth full? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're, you're, you're good to go. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of fun stuff, but the honor code, that is very interesting. Really good stuff, don't lie, cheat, or steal. Positive peer pressure, how about that? Good morning, Holly. Time to talk a little sports. My friend Madison here is on the golf team, freshman. And what you guys just have the region, just region, just got done with that the other day. She's gonna putt. Prom too. So try your putt, see if we can get it in the cup. It's kind of like putt-putt. So we're gonna test her skills on live TV. Smooth, smooth. Oh! Well, this morning we are taking you on a tour of the Web School out in Bellbuckle. Aaron Solomon shows us around. <laughs> Hey, something else really cool here at Webb School is this awesome library. Actually, the school was founded with a whole lot of books. And so the school's founder, Sonny Webb, started the school with just $12,000, but $8,000 was spent on books. So books are a big thing here, huh? That's right. It's 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 a big deal. We actually have some of that original collection. And you have 3,000 yes. from back then? Yes. I think that there were about 8,000 books in that original collection. We have some books that were written shortly after the Civil War that were written about the Civil War, so those oh, wow. are kind of interesting, yeah. too. Hey, something else really cool here at the Webb School is their cool athletic complex. Fairly new, uh, what, nine years old, something like that, eight years yeah, old, Mr. Good. Dorsett, but uh, this is really nice, especially for a school this size. Yes, uh, you know, the one thing that I enjoyed a lot is coming up here to see the facilities that we have, and uh, uh, even with the numbers of uh, students that we have, there's not very many facilities around that, that compare to even what we have with 320 kids here. Something else really cool here at the Web School is the Black Box Theater, and we got a Harley in the theater. Alack, alack, is it not like that I so early waking? We have a core of about 28 kids, and if I could cast all 28 every show, I would do that. Not sure we could afford the costumes. <laughs> First, what do you like about performing on stage? Everything. I mean, this is what I want to eventually do with my life. And so, Miss Cordell has been a great starting point. And she came and she opened me up. I blossomed in her class. The kids been bonus with the class. Dash up my desperate brain. 
Aaron is live in Bedford County out at the Webb School in Bellbuckle. Hey, good morning, Aaron. Hey, Holly. Very special place. 141 years they've been around. The oldest continuously operating boarding school in the entire South. We've seen some orchestras in the past, but I don't see if we've seen this many violins. Let's take a quick listen to the string section here at Webb School. Very cool. They're very cool. Here's some more cool stuff about the Webb School. How about that, Holly? Yeah, you got uh, kind of on your own. It kind of gets you ready for college pretty quickly, away from home. Sixth through twelfth grade, about 300 students. About a third of them are boarders. They have kids from 10 different states, eight different countries. And yes, this is the Snowbird theme and Snowbird directing. Cool stuff from Webb throughout the next hour. <laughs> we'll come back to Bell Buckle in just a bit. Pretty awesome. So much talent there. Checking out the uh, stream. Hey, Holly, when you've been around 141 years, like the Webb School, you have a lot of tradition, including the senior board something each senior class does they go in on this project and uh, how long has the senior board been going on since the 1940s students have been making a senior board very cool and then when they come back for the reunions they kind of pose with it and see it and right here we got some artwork the bowls down here and they're for a purpose what's the name of the project the empty bowls project yeah, empty bowls project for luncheon in October they're raising money for some local charities good stuff here here's some more cool stuff about web school <laughs> All right, something else really cool here at the Web School. They got strings, and they're really cool. They're going to play for us. Check them out. It's hard to clap when you're holding a violin. Hey, what's cool about being able to play this instrument here at school? I don't know a lot of schools that have strings programs, so I think it's really nifty that we have one. About twice a year we have a performance for the school. Um, for either Parents' Day or some special occasion. Okay. Or you do something together? Mm -hmm. Okay. Is it cool to, to sing with them? It is cool. It's different, but it's nice because it makes you have to project and work on your voice more. We go from something calm and cool and quiet to something rowdy. Web Feet, that is the athletic nickname, the Web Feet. They're doing their Web Feet dominate cheer. Kind of the mascot in the shape of a foot. Call them the feet because the students determined back in the 1970s that every sport you play, really you have to use your feet. So the foot, the most important part of your body when you compete in any athletic event. So they're the Web Feet. And this is their cheer. Holly, pretty cool, huh? The Web Feet dominate cheer. I love We've heard one of those before. Pretty cool. Hey, Holly, we moved outside the dining hall. At least we're done eating for the moment. Lots of cool stuff here at Web School, including the shirts. They worked up some cool shirts for us. This is cool. And by the way, do you ever wonder where's Web? Who's Web? Well, here's the founder of the school. Kind of. Look at this huge puppet that was made with an artist and students last year over there after their founder, Sawney Webb. Aaron at the Webb School in Bellbuckle. Hey, Aaron. Hey, Holly. How about this pretty picture? The sun coming up over Bedford County, Middle Tennessee, and Webb School got their founder, at least a puppet of the founder, Sawney Webb, right here. Bellbuckle, Tennessee, a gorgeous school, 141 years of history. Mr. Broadhead, we've had a great time. You guys got a really cool school. Thank you, Aaron. We were delighted that you were able to come to Web School Bell Buckle today, you and Snowbird. Thank you for coming. All right, we got a couple of gifts to exchange here, but very cool stuff. You got to tune in next Monday to find out where we're going next, what we're doing with cool schools. But Holly, we're going to have some fun here right now. I know you will. Okay, thank you. Bring back some of those waffles. Aaron, live at a yeah, good school popular. in Bell Buckle, Bedford County. Good morning to you. All right, that is Channel 4 News today. Hey, Channel 4 viewers, thank you for coming to visit us at the Web School today. Now you know why we are such a cool and unique school.